Welcome to the world of the Integrated Aqua Vegiculture System, or as we call it, IAVS. Hi, I'm Gary Donaldson. People who are looking to satisfy themselves or their partner that aquaponics is for them will often construct a small system prior to committing resources to a larger project. While this is understandable, it overlooks the fact that very often the smaller the system, the greater the difficulty in maintaining water quality. Most desktop systems are located indoors, under inadequate lighting, so they usually end up producing little in the way of plants. With that in mind, I decided to build an IAVS demonstration system to see just how easy it is and how well it works, and I am curious about how much real food can be produced in a growing area of just four square feet. To that end, I give you the IABS demo unit. Okay, let's begin with a look at the components in the system. A high density polyethylene plastic tub will serve as the fish tank. It measures 760 millimeters by 560 millimeters by 460 millimeters deep, and it holds 200 liters of water. The fish tank is fitted with an overflow outlet to prevent the fish escaping should the tank overfill due to rain or human error. We've used two black polyethylene tubs as sand biofilters. Each tub is 540 millimetres by 360 millimetres by 270 millimetres deep and each holds 50 litres of sand. The sand beds are supported on cement blocks and treated pine sleepers so that they drain directly back into the fish tank. A submersible pond pump supplies water to the sand beds. This air pump provides 180 to 480 litres of air per hour. It's larger than I need, but I already have this one on hand, and it features a battery backup that operates in the event of a power failure, a very useful feature indeed. The air pump will supply two Sweetwater air stones. A programmable timer controls the irrigation cycles for the system. And then there's the most important component, the sand. This system uses 100 litres of washed and graded sand, weighing around 140 kilos. OK, let's put it all together. My first task was to drill six 8 millimetre holes in the sand beds at the point where the end meets the bottom. We have to ensure that the sand stays in the bed while allowing the water to drain. So I made up a shade cloth pad around which I packed wet sand to hold it in place. Then the sand was shoveled into the grow beds. The irrigation system comprises a water pump, several control valves and some micro irrigation fittings, all connected together with soft poly tube. The pump was placed in the fish tank and the inflow end was zip tied onto the sand beds. The fish tank was filled with water and we're ready to start pumping. As far as the build goes, it's certainly the simplest system I've ever put together. And being able to get everything off the shelf made it quick and easy too. Well that concludes part one of the IABS demo unit. In part two we'll focus on the startup and we'll begin to learn something about how well it works. This is Gary Donaldson, wishing you well and I'll be with you again soon. Bye for now. Thank you for your interest in the integrated aqua vegiculture system. We hope you enjoyed this presentation and you can obtain more information at www.iavs.info.